let's dive into this. And this is the single most important thing to me, which is the culture. Understanding how, you know, this is like just the internals of everything that is important to me and this agency and for anybody else that is a part of this. So at the very, very top, and I know we've talked about this a lot, excellence. Okay. Now, this is obviously what we're striving for. That isn't really, you know, um, I don't think there is a standard where we say, hey, you know, we have reached it. So it's always just, um, you know, committing to the fundamentals, finishing a job 100% being honorable, uh, doing, just doing the right thing, doing the right thing every single time, honesty, transparency, you know, there is so much garbage in this industry and there is a lot in here when it comes to sales and with these types of things and things that we're going to be dealing with where it, you, I don't want to say they're gray areas, but it, it is, you know, there's a lot of moral calls, um, here we're dealing with people's monies and there's not necessarily right or wrong answers. So just, honesty and transparency the whole freaking way through um just keeping a clean nose this just makes life so much easier <laughs> uh, yeah. you know um so these are super freaking important these two i'm really excited about because these are my own personal twist on things assertive positivity and aggressive <laughs> encouragement so um these are things where as a team, I think one thing in life and in business, but I think also just in life, really having a team that can hold you to high standards that we've all agreed to. And mm -hmm. part of that has to do with um, assertive positivity. So like when you hear somebody like being negative is actually realizing being like, oh no, okay, I actually have to step up and be like, hey, let's, and not being, you know, this, this foo-foo like, hey, yada, you know, like not toxic positivity, but actually being like, hey, <laughs> You know, this is hard. It does get hard. But whether you folk, whatever you focus on is where, you know, your outcomes are going to be. And then the aggressive encouragement is on the same aspect of that. Um, you know, like really getting into people's faces because energy, not necessarily on a hippie standpoint, but like, uh, but from but all kind of the standpoints, <laughs> but kind of from a sports yeah. standpoint, from a psychological standpoint. Yeah, just, yeah. No, um, frame things makes a difference. Yeah. But yeah, just like, yeah. helping reframe things or to like bring certain things to light and just like, you know, yeah. pat, pat, pat on the back, you know. Yeah. You know? And, but, and yeah. these are really, you know, this is for the team. This is for everybody in here because this isn't particularly easy. You know, this is simple, but you know, we're kind of, this is a, a different adventure where you only get paid on your merits and we're all basically starting out on so many things and there are tons of highs and lows in this thing. So, um, and more than anything else, you know, on here, you'll see, there's not a lot here that has to do with money. These are the types of things that I think, you know, if we can focus on these, the fruits of our outcomes will be, beautiful um yeah other things you know reaching our potential i you guys we have had a lot of like talks and i've been on like I, I um friend friendly terms and all of these things now i'm going in not that i won't be friendly but as the agency owner you know now it's my my hope and my goal to stoke the fires and really get the potential out of you and not mm -hmm. that does not mean 80 hour work weeks, that means like holding you to a standard that you agree to, holding you to these excellence, to, you know, the honesty and the transparency. And like, hey, if you're going to do these things, you said you were going to do these things, I'm going to hold you to these things. And I am, I do yeah. expect this, this will be a challenge. This will be a challenge for all of us. Um, that's what I am hoping. And I, I'm just trying to lay that stage where I am really, really hoping there, the, the, the opportunities that come from this industry are ridiculous and phenomenal. And I, and I think that so many people fall off because these things aren't in place. So, uh, you know, just also being able to commit to that and knowing like, Hey, you know, we're here and I would not be, I would not ask you guys here if I didn't think that you had a lot of potential, I wouldn't be wasting my time. So, um, hard work. I mean, that is just so important to me. I am just, it is I think it should kind of almost go without saying, but I'm going to say it. And I'm going to say it over and over and over. Like this is pretty much in this industry. This is the beautiful thing about it. There are two things you get paid for, your talent or your effort. And at first we still have to build the talent. So the effort, if you can do this, you will be very, very well taken care of financially. 
on that note, pick your struggles. There's going to be a lot of struggles. Embrace the problems. Celebrate the overcoming these things um, because these are things where, you know, we are, I do not want to treat you as like low level employees or desk jockeys. There are going to be lots of expectations over and over and over and challenges over and over and over. Um, let's dig into it because you can either struggle um, trying to figure out what the hell to do, or you can struggle doing it. I saw a great picture a while back. It was a split version of a person. It was like AI and it was, so it was the same person. One of them is they were like super in shape and like jacked. And the other one, they were super overweight and it said struggle or struggle. Um, so <laughs> what struggle do you want to have? Um, I, yeah. So let's yeah. pick, let's pick the good ones. Let's pick the ones that bring us the skills that we're looking for. Um, <laughs> This one here, I know, Evan, we we do a pretty good job at this. Continually asking why. That goes for myself. Uh, Almost there's to a, a fault. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, hey, this is okay. But, you know, we'll, <laughs> this is, this is great, but this is part of it. This is part of it, um, is always asking because guys, we are actually doing a lot of new things. We are, we are, so much of this is new and especially trying to combine it all. Um, mm -hmm. and we are all trying to figure it out. I am not going to claim that I know these things. I think I have good ideas. My job is to kind of have ideas and put, you know, have us test them at the same time. You guys are intelligent human beings and in every aspect of this. And this is also a massive principle in just sales in general. Why did you call? Why do you want life insurance? Why are you protecting this person? Why are you afraid? Why are you, why, 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 why? Getting into asking questions is also a very important thing. Um, have an open mind. First principle thinking. The idea, have a good plan today is better than a great plan tomorrow. Uh, we're figuring this out. So there are always going to be times. Evan knows I, I can probably to a fault plan. And so we are more in the action mode right now. So just also understanding there are going to be times where we can probably have other things figured out, but we are still in action mode. We're always going to be in action mode. And if we continue to make, if we always continue to pick a good plan today, eventually we will only be left with very good options. So, um, and then just remember what you can control and focus on that. And this sales is very, very, very simple. This is a complete numbers game so and there are many things that you can't control in this you know you're dealing with people exclusively people so um it, you know getting into what we can control and committing to that is important part of the process